start. Oh, it's hot. Okay, it's not that bad. Okay, y'all. Okay. Welcome back to my channel. Okay, so from the title, sorry my hair looks kind of crazy. You already know what we're doing today. We are going to be rejuvenating and reviving this old wig that I have. If you haven't seen this video, I haven't seen a video about this wig, I'll pop it right here, but I made it a couple months ago about how I installed that wig. But today, we are going to be reviving it because I'm gonna show you in a minute, but it looks completely trash, okay? So a company reached out to me. Their name is Observer. So their name is Observer, and it is like a hair company, but they don't sell wigs or anything. They sell products to wash, condition it, and just revamp an old wig. Those are the type of products that they sell, and they were kind enough to send me some of those products. So I have the box sitting right in front of me. I will do like a unboxing thing. I'll show you guys on camera so you guys can just see what comes in the box and whatever and everything that you get. So yeah, I'm probably just gonna pop that up right now. So this is how the box looks when you first open it. It has the pamphlet of what all comes in the box. And the first thing you see is the all-in-one thermal wig travel case. And this is what you put your wig in so it can heat up and just get rejuvenated or whatever. Next is the conditioner. And then the last thing in the box comes with the shampoo. So, yeah. Now I am just unboxing and opening the thermal kit. And it is very nicely packaged. I'm sorry for the bad angle. But like I was saying, it's very nicely packaged. And it comes with plastic wrap on it. Um, now I'm just opening the plastic wrap because I didn't have any scissors. So I'm just using my nails. All right, so now that you have seen everything that comes in the box, I just want to give a big shout out to Observer for sending me these products and yeah for having me be able to revamp this old way because without these products i probably would just do the wig away because i don't even know how to do all that y'all know what it is so i thank you for observer for sending me all of these amazing products and let's just get right into the video okay so if you don't know who i am my name is mckinley brooke and i make fashion vlogs hair and makeup type of videos i mostly make fashion and hair so if you're interested in any of that type of content, make sure you stop this video, go down, hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, turn on the bell notifications. And after this video, make sure you just head over to my channel and just check out all the other type of content that I have on there. You will love it. All right, so, so my hair is like natural or whatever right now. I just washed it and conditioned it. And this is how it's looking. Well, and this is how it's looking, but I'm going to moisturize it and, I'm sorry, I'm making the camera shake. I'm going to moisturize it and just braid it up and then I'll come back on camera. All right, so now I just grabbed a empty like bowl or whatever and put some water in it and now I'm just submerging the hair and the water just to get started on the washing process as you see i'm trying to like kind of finger detangle as i go but just really um just getting the hair pretty wet and now i'm showing you guys the um amino acid balance shampoo from observer and this is what it looks like it comes in plastic wrap and i'm just going to take that off and start putting the shampoo into the bowl and just making sure I really get this wig clean because it really needed some work. <laughs> so here I am just running my fingers through the hair and just making sure the hair gets thoroughly um, clean. And I'm also making sure the lace, this wasn't even the lace. I don't know why I was going so hard on this part. <laughs> but that was just like the invisible scalp thing I think. Not invisible. 
you know what I'm saying but I don't know why I was really trying to get that clean but I was but as you can see I am just still washing the hair and just making sure I get all the dirt and products that I've put in this wig out so I can have a fresh restart Here is the wig after being washed. I know it looks really bad right now, but I promise, I promise it's going to look a whole lot better. But I'm just showing you the lace and whatever the other brown part is. I don't know what that's called. But yeah, so this is how it looks after being washed. I know it looks worse than what I started off with, honestly. But just wait until I add the conditioner like I'm showing you right now. And you will see that I promise it will look a whole lot better. But now I am just running my fingers through the hair or trying to because it is pretty tangled because I did not comb it out before I washed it and now thinking back I should have probably combed the wig out before putting it in all that water and stuff but now I am just taking a, a nice amount of the conditioner and just trying to run it through the hair and making sure I, eat, I get all parts of the hair even the top so yeah that's basically all that I'm doing in this clip and now I am about to prepare the the kit the thermal kit and I'm just taking off the plastic and I'm about to plug it up and when, once you get this kit you will see how long um, everything takes and what temperature to put it on I just put it on the highest one even though it didn't say that but that's all I did I now all you do is just put the wig and the kit and you zip it up and you wait 30 minutes and after that what you will do is take the wig out after you waited 30 minutes and it is definitely warm so be be careful of that because I did kind of burn myself just a little bit but be careful of that and now I'm just running my fingers through it seeing if the hair has softened up and it definitely did soften up so yeah so now I am just brushing through the wig and I still have all the conditioner in this wig. I just took it out of the like microwave basically but I just took it out of that and now I'm just trying to get all of the tangles out. So yeah. So I finally got all the tangles out and you can definitely see a major difference in this wig as of now. Alright y'all ignore my fan. I'll turn it off once I like really start getting into it but i know you guys have been watching the voiceover i know i look crazy but now it's going to start getting into me like talking through everything and stuff but i just got finished rinsing all of the conditioner out on this wig and i will say it definitely made this hair extremely soft so yeah now i'm just combing through it making sure all the tangles are out I just place it on top of my head. Don't worry. This is not how it's like finishing going to look. But yeah, this is how long it is. This is how long the wig is. It goes like down to here on me. But what I'm about to do now is just... I finished combing it and this is how it looks. It's a body wave wig. Yeah, but I finished combing it and now I'm just about to let it air dry and then when I the next time you see me I will start blow drying it. Okay lovelies, so I don't know remember where oh I had my wig on the last clip that you saw. So now it is fully air well, it's not fully, but I just let it air dry in front of the fan and this is how it's looking. Oh my gosh. This wig looks so much better. Like it looks a little dry on camera. But I, f I didn't even know I had this much curls. Like, what the heck? I'm really loving this. Okay, observer. Go off. Go. Why is my head shining? Go off. Go off. So, yeah. Just put one. Okay. Heck, I'm just going to my cap. And I'll probably do this just because, like, I need to take my baby hairs out and stuff. Yeah. And, like, readjust my braids so they won't get smoky. So, yeah. So. Okay. Let's see what we're looking at. Okay. Oh, yes. I'm definitely going to straighten it because I, don't, I like the curls, but I also just don't really like them. So, yeah. But this is how it looks. I'll back up some. It's very soft. I can just run my fingers through it. That's how it looks in the back. Yeah. 
I'm I'm messing with it. I'm messing with how it looks like like it just feels so much better. So shout out to Observer for revamping this wig. So I am gonna straighten it and all that stuff. So yeah, let's just get into it. Alright y'all, so the first thing that I'm gonna be doing is my baby hairs. So I'm just gonna pull those out right now. So, I'm about to put back on this wig and let's see what it's looking like. I don't know why I am singing. So here we go, this is how it's looking. you guys so come to find out i don't have a flat iron i know i did i don't know where it went that should tell you the last time that i flat ironed some hair some natural hair any type of hair so what i'm gonna do is just use a curling iron and just curl the hair because i don't flat iron i know what type of person am I? but i'm gonna pick one up tomorrow because I have another wig that just got sent to me and it's here now and I'm I want to fire on that so I'll just go to the beauty supply and pick one up but that's for another video but for this video I'm going to use this curling iron all right guys so I know you still hear my fan but I am now about to start this is like I'm sorry there you go I am now about to start oh it's not trying to curl my hair. I'm getting it really close to my face. So let me hold up. to get my hot comb to just try to make this part a little flatter. 